Hello everybody, this is Hot Fuzz at PlayStationCollecting.com with the video for you of my UMD movie collection. I'm actually in the storage area where I keep all my UMD movies on some some shelves. And I'd like to show you first my sci-fi collection. I'm going to actually do the video in a couple of parts because I have got quite a, quite a lot of UMD movies to show you. So be sure to look back uh, and check out my other videos. So we're going to start on the first shelf here. At the top here we've got the Eon Flux movies on UMD. Now this UMD movie here, Eon Flux, the animated series, was only actually um, brought out in the US so I had to actually import this movie. That's it there. Animated series you can see. Complete animated collection. Um, this was actually a series on MTV. Um, as I haven't actually watched it yet, believe it or not. But apparently it's it's reported to be very good and I do I do like animated movies. Then we've got the next Eon Flux movie which was uh, an Italian release to the to the EU market which never made it to the English shores so I had to have this in my collection. Charlie's Theron there on the front cover. Eon Flux UMD and then we've got Akira, Akira animated movie, got the alien movies there, got Beowulf, Cowboy Bebop, Dark Crystal, Dark Star, got District 9. We've got here the Doctor Who movies, I'll just show you one of those. This was actually my favourite new series of the Doctor Who uh, remake of the series. Um, and Christopher, Ex uh, Christopher Eccleston's brilliant in it. He's one of my favourite actors. And he was in a recent series on BBC One called Shadowline, which was brilliant. Now, moving on, we've got Doom there, uh, Dune, Equilibrium, got the Final Fantasy movies, Battlestar Galactica, which um, was three episodes off the US hit. TV series you can see there and I just wanted to take you back to um, the Doom movie this was actually um, a unique release in the sense that it was in an all black cover if you can see there this UMD actually comes in a black cover whereas most UMDs um, came in clear covers so it's quite unusual that one. And we've got Heavy Metal there. We've got Hitchhiker's Guide to Galaxy, the Hollow Man movies, I Am Legend, Independence Day, I Robot, Island, Jumper. As you can tell, I'm quite an avid sci-fi fan, and quite a lot of my UND movies are sci-fi movies. Got the Matrix movies there, Perfect Blue animated movie. Got this nice Planet of the Apes movie with some really cool artwork on the front, which was a US release, which I imported from the US. One of my friends sent it over to me from the forum, which is quite nice. We've got Robocop the Predator, Chronicles of Riddick, Serenity, Species. Got Stargate, which was another US release. Just let you have a look at that one. Stargate there. Again, a really nice cool cover there. Then we've got Stealth, Steam Boy, Starship Troopers, Starship Troopers Armada, Sunshine, The Day the Earth Stood Still and Fifth Element. Now if I can just open one of these UMD movies for you and just let you sh show you the insides of the covers. Now a lot of UMD movies actually have art inside the movie cover itself. I can just show you. Um, which sort of adds to the appeal of collecting um, UMD movies. If you can see there, the art inside the cover. I'll just show you the disc. The disc is pretty cool. So yeah, this is one of the reasons why I like collecting UMD movies. Because the 
they're nice to watch but they're also nice to look at as well in a collection and as I said they've, most of them have got art inside there's only a few that um, are plain covers inside them I've got another movie up here on the top which I didn't have room for on my shelves at the moment and it's Blue Sky which is an animated movie it's not that common to find but it's not it's not that hard of a movie to find out really on UMD then we've got at the top here it's not strictly a sci-fi movie but I got this one the other week and we've got Warriors on UMD this is a pretty tough title to find and on the next shelf going down we've got in the corner the Jet Lee's the one we've got Time Bandits 12 Monkeys Total Recall 12 Monkeys and Total Recall were French releases um, Tron there you can see that's an American release and then we've got the Terminator movies here now Terminator 2 here just let me show you this one this is actually quite a special movie because it was quite difficult to find in the US but even more difficult to find here in the UK because it was never actually given um, a UK release this was actually bought whilst on holiday in France and I believe not very many of these were actually pressed so there's not many of them about and I'm one of the lucky enough people to have it in my collection which is really cool because I do like to have full sets of movies it would be awful to think I'd have all three movies and not the fourth one so there's my Terminator collection then got X-Files got my Batman collection there just like to show you this one here is a Japanese release of Batman Begins there some nice cover art on it and then we've got Constantine, Daredevil, Elektra the Fantastic Four movies, Ghost Rider Godzilla, Hancock got the Hulk movies there, the, the re-release and, and the newest one got the Hellboy movies and, and a director's cut of Hellboy as well got the King Kong double disc set now this particular movie because it's such a long movie it was over three hours long what they've actually had to do is split the the UND well the film into two UNDs so it's got actually two discs in the box which is pretty cool then we've got Max Payne got the Punisher got the Punisher um, box set there which is the Punisher collection which has both Punisher movies in it to show you that Punisher collection there got Spawn which was an American release animated movie show you that there Quite cool. Then we've got the Spider Man movies, got Superman Returns, the League of Extraordinary Gentlemen, got the, got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie. I had to have that in my collection, that's funny. Ultraviolet, Van Helsing, got the X Men movies there. And then here, starting with my um, horror movie collection, this is quite a, a unique UND. I've not seen this one before. I actually picked picked it up off eBay, and it's quite a rare UND. I've not seen anybody else with it as, as present. Probably is other copies about, but I've not actually seen one with it. And it's it's a remake. Well, it's not a, a remake, should I say? It's 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 a film of the game. The computer game alone in the dark so it's pretty cool don't know if you've watched the movie it's not that good of a movie it's okay mediocre but just had to have that on UND so this is the first part of um, of my UND movie collection hope you enjoyed uh, watching it and seeing a few of my titles 
Um, be sure to look back and watch the, the, the second part. Might even be a third part, depending on uh, how many UMDs I get through. So thank you very much for watching again. This is Hot Fuzz at PlayStationCollecting.com and see you again.